This is Apollo Saturn Launch Control. We passed the six-minute mark in our countdown for Apollo 11, the flight to land of the first men on the moon. Ten, nine, ignition sequence start. Six. I think perhaps the final descent to the lunar surface was, uh, for me, the, the highlight of the flight. It was very challenging. Uh, there were a lot of unknowns. Um, and uh, it, it was, uh, for a pilot, it, it was uh, a wonderful experience. Okay, Neil, we can see you coming down the ladder now. Uh, the ladder, the limb footbed, ground mist, uh, is very fine. I'm going to step off the limb. That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. Oh, that looks beautiful from here, Neil. Well, actually, I didn't worry about it until after landing because uh, I guess in my own view, we didn't have uh, that good a chance of completing a successful landing. Uh, but it was, uh, I did think about it between the, the time of landing and the, and the time when we actually exited the spacecraft. It was and I did that. Eagle, Houston, we, Houston, we see you on the stairwell, over. Roger, how does it look? My concerns uh, were not within the command module, but simply that something might go wrong with the uh, LAM, with the lunar module, and these two guys might get stuck on the surface of the moon. That was my, my main concern. Zero, 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 two, nine, or three. Roger, the EVA is progressing beautifully. They're setting up the flag now. I guess you're about the only person around that doesn't have TV coverage of the scene. That's all right, I don't mind a bit. They've got the flag up now, and you can see the stars and stripes on the lunar surface. The, the uh, various paces that a person can traveling on the lunar surface you do have to be. All right, you do have to be uh, rather careful. Uh, it was a stranger to me uh, before the mission, but it, I now look back at it as somewhat of a friend, a place that I've visited. Not really. 